Hola and bienvenidos everybody, my name is Nitpick and if you don't know who I am, I am a music educator and a flutist who really enjoys all kinds of music. So today we are checking out another Koei AI video. Now you're probably like, another? This is your first one on YouTube. Correct! I have a video that I did on Patreon. My belief is if I do one on Patreon, I have to have one on YouTube because it needs to be shared, especially if I like really dig it. I just learned about Lisa X, Hazuki, Kotono, and Kanare from that video. And I was like, where have I been? We're gonna dive into their official live video of one way or another. But before we do that, if you end up liking the channel, please like and subscribe. And if you wanna check out more, there's some links down in the description. If, while you're watching the video, you can click on the link to the Discord or check out the Patreon and scroll through. There's some extra content there as well as some free content that gets blocked on YouTube. So let's jump right in. Okay, immediately at the beginning. It's funny because in this portion that we just listened to, it's like they're playing coy. Cause I know, I know what Lisa and Hazuki are capable of. They're playing coy. Anyway, I wanna go back. Cause the opening, I just, the way Lisa X does the, the, the screechies, the wailing. I think I said this in the other video, it's very Van Halen. It's just those, those squeals. And I love, I love it. I, those, that's like one of my favorite effects on guitar that people can do. Wait, are those the pinch harmonics? When it comes to electric guitar, I just knew how to palm mute and play chords because I did a lot of punk rock. I didn't do a lot of this kind of, you know, cool stuff, so, but. There's something about this. What? Oh. <laughs> Ma'am, does it sound like ACDC? She was a fast machine. She kept a motor clean. <laughs> Shook me all night long. That's the chord progression. It's close, but it's not quite. Hear me out. Mm. She must have been feeling some Angus Young that day. <laughs> it's so cool. Ma'am! I love the, the camera on the bass. Her voice. And then all of a sudden, a shift in personality. We've left. It's weird because it feels like we leave that old school rock and roll. And now we're in a Heavy pop rock? Anything, 
This makes me think of Rush. Do you hear it? Yeah. Let's keep going. DC meets Rush. <laughs> I like the chord progression in this chorus. It's cool because it goes down and then back up. I want some I want to feel like I'm not crazy and I, I don't mean to do comparisons a lot to like modern day bands that we know really well the reason why I do it is because and someone had a better quote than I did and I cannot remember it for the life of me it'll pop up someday because I know that person is probably gonna watch another video and I hope they do so they can tell me what it is again but great composers steal and borrow from other musicians. And this is normal. Copyright exists because we want to protect the artist, okay? But you cannot copyright a chord progression because there's only so many that exist. That's how it is. That's that's how that rule kind of works. I think one of the craziest things I remember watching was the Ed Sheeran and uh, Marvin Gaye chord progression. It's, it just, it happens that way. It just happens to happen that way. So like, for instance, we get this, we get this ACDC style opening and it could be that she was writing and it came out that way and she didn't even realize it. And then when you hear it, you hear it. And then that middle portion has this rush type sound. Maybe she's a fan. That's kind of how it came about, maybe. I don't know. It's just something kind of, you know, digging through the thought process here. But yeah, that's that's what I hear. Correct me if I'm wrong, but like, tell me if you hear it too. Ooh, I love that. Mm, the accents. No, we going back. We going back. We have to go back. We we have to go back because we got to hear that. Oh, because both of these guitar players, both Lisa X and Hazuki, I listened to my first Lisa X recording as well on Patreon, and I was absolutely taken with both of these ladies. Pinch harmonics. That was, that's what they're called. I like pinch harmonics. I love the accents from the cymbals. Look at how easy she makes it look. Hazuki holding down fort. And then... Woo! And then she comes in with the more lyrical solo. Yes. I love the two different styles of solos. We play chords here to create a different effect. Building up tension. And then...
love the sound of this portion. <laughs> Get it. Yes. Okay, I have a question for drummers, if you have an answer. Is there a name for that sound that drummers do at the end before they do that, like, last thing? Like, this. That that sound. Is there a name for that? Because I've always wondered, because I've noticed every drummer does it at the end of a song or the end of a set or whatever. I'm just curious, because I, it's cool. Just curious. Anyway, I noticed when I was digging through their channel that they don't have a lot of music yet, and I'm hoping that changes, because I really like this group together. The only thing I noticed is that they don't, I don't think they have a permanent bass player yet. And I think the bass player, from what I was told, is the bassist from East of Eden, which is cool. Like, even though she's not a permanent member, at least she's like, she's like, hey, I'm, I'm willing to do it. Hopefully this group stays together. Although I do love a good side project, so good for them. Lisa X, I want more. I need to dive into more of her music because her, Hazuki, they are a power duo. Even by themselves, like, I want to know what they do because... It's good. This is fun. This is fun music. Oh my god. I'm definitely gonna need more. <laughs> so, after this video, I'm gonna want all the, like, suggestions that I can get. All these ladies, tell me where they come from so I can dive deeper. The deeper we can go into that rabbit hole, the better, right? So, Anyway, let's continue the conversation about music. What do you like about Koei? What do you like about this performance? Have you checked out the other performance? A new picture? Because that's the one I did on Patreon and I was absolutely taken and that's why I'm here. So let me know what you think down in the comments. And again, if you like the channel, please like and subscribe. And if you really want to check out more, there's those links down in the description for my Discord and my Patreon where you can check out extra content as well as free content. I hope you're having a great day and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace out.